Welcome to GA Style Peels. Uh, today I'm gonna show you, it's gonna be a really quick video. Uh, I'm not gonna be doing much. I'm just gonna show you one thing. Uh, where to find a thermostat on uh, Mercedes-Benz 2009 by the look of it. It's the W204 model, as long as I know. And basically, this is the front end of the car. That's what it looks, that's what it should look like at yours. Uh, basically, this is a 2.2 litre diesel, I believe so. And basically, the thermostat location is, I know there is two different there's two different ones. There's one for there's one plastic casing and there is one metal casing. Uh, I've got the one which has got the uh, plastic casing, but I have no clue how the metal one looks like. Well, I kind of know because I've seen it online, but I don't exactly 100% know where it's going. But <clears throat> basically, this will be your guideline <coughs> as. Uh, W204 diesel 2009 has got no well basic engine is like that that is your cover there and this bad boy here on the front this is your thermostat this one right here this is plastic housing so all you do is you pop one pipe from here disconnect these pipes disconnect this pipe this has been messed up already because there should be a factory one some light on. As you can see, see there is the hole, and these two pipes should be joining in within this plastic uh, thing here. But I took it out because somebody's already stuck a thicker one, and that was a bit slack, so that one probably sealed properly. So I'll never put it back in. Then you've got these one clip in here, and then another clip, as you can see below there, that needs to come down. <coughs> Get yourself pliers like these. These are hose pipe clip removal tool. I think it's like 10, 15 quid on eBay. Brilliant tool. You definitely want to get one of these. Um, so yeah, basically you just pop them clips, wiggle it out. T11 uh, or 10, I think my arm was using 11, E11. So that is the one ball there. And then another one just down there, as you can see, and then one from this side there, come on focus, there, there we go, that's where the bad boy is there, so three bolts, pops off, pops back in, and happy days, I had, uh, I had, uh, I plugged my computer in, and basically, it came up with a thermostat fault, and uh, so that's why I'm changing this one, so basically this is the old unit, as you can see and again there shouldn't be water inside here I've got water so we'll have to change that for proper coolant because these engines run hotter and if you have American it overheats and you don't know what's the problem pop the bonnet have a look in your coolant system what have you got whether you've got water or whether you've got coolant if you've got coolant you've got problems if you haven't got coolant that's your issue so this is the thermostat and as you can see it's been leaking from the top already it's been leaking kind of on the side a little bit somewhere or just deposits from the top here and when i was trying to pop the thing off you can see that the plastic on the coolant is actually disintegrated itself so this was a well overdue yeah because this is a factory part that's the part number if you want to see Two second, I'm gonna clean this off. So this is the part number A651-200-0615. So there you go, peeps. That's one thermostat finish. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna finish this all off, put everything back together, drain the stupid water, and uh, I've got nice coolant in there ready waiting for us so right peeps thanks a lot for watching hopefully come in handy for somebody i've been looking for this stuff but i couldn't find anything but i just go for it 
and uh, and but yeah, if you if you if you liked it, give us a shallow shallow. <laughs> give us a follow, peeps. Like, comment, thanks a lot, and I'll see you in the next one. Farah.